Swane. I'm 21 years old and I'm playing for Tag's first ladies team and the youth team. Because of my ability with football, I got a bursary. So football gave me the opportunity to study here and to get a degree so that later on in life, I will have the opportunity to apply my academic skills um, for my life. I'm Cindy Limay, I'm 21 years of age. I'm currently studying at the University of Victoria. I'm doing my master's in sports management. It was in my second year that I actually realized that I can make a profession out of this. And this is when I started to concentrate more on my soccer. And then that's when I represented South Africa at the World Student Games. It was actually through my academics. I didn't go for football. I actually stopped playing football for fun overall. But then when I got to university, that's when I actually realized the importance of sport and how big a person can make it once you enter the university level. basically where soccer is just a tradition and every girl or guy plays. It was just my passion. I, I figured I belong there. Hi, my name is Simkwe Lulu, also known as Shori. And I have represented the national team 49 times, yes, 49 caps under my belt. And I was also the captain of the team. Something really interesting happened in my journey to the national team. I actually got the senior um, teams call up before getting the under 20 call up and for me that was amazing because I've been striving to get into the junior team because I was at the um, at the academy and at that age it's just junior program before the senior team and for me that was really amazing. When I was 15 um, I got into a team called Drow which is UJ now played at Rao for two years and then from there I moved to the High Performance Centre which was the academy that was newly established for girls in South Africa so I was one of the girls that got the opportunity to go and pursue a career in sports there specifically football and also to study there because I was still in high school. This is so special is that you know she's a great motivator she's a very friendly person she can fit in at any, in any crowd and you know she's you know, she can whip up a crowd, you know, make them excited. I got the opportunity to be at the high performance where everything was high performance. The facilities, um, the dining hall, the food that was prepared for the athletes there, it was high quality and suitable, adequate for sports people. Um, the level of education we got there was special education that we got because we were sports people uh, considering that we train um, hard and also that we also needed to be educated. And there's never a dull moment when she's around. Everything she does, you know, she puts everything into it. And that's what makes her so special. And I still say that education is very important because currently I have a degree under my belt because of, of um, the level of education I got at that early age. You know, because I, I had the balance. I had the balance between school and, and sports, football specifically. So um, that's the reason why I, I wanted to be involved with Marvel because they are also an organization that pushes um, education through sports. I was picked to be captain because of my discipline, dedication and determination on and off the field. I was part of something very big in South Africa and that was the final World Cup draw in 2009. And being part of that was just amazing. It was an epic achievement. Um, also, the second one was when I got Sportswoman of the Year at the University of Victoria. I think, <laughs> yeah, that would fall into my career highlights. It, it was a big one, and I think I'll treasure that all my life. Yeah. It's because of these underprivileged kids, like I was once, part of them and like them that Marvin has developed and, and has the passion to help them become better people, better sports people, better communities. And because they're developing sports and education, which are big elements that made me who I am today. And because I also want to see them be better than me, Marvel is part of that. Living the dream. I'm also living the dream with them. What's stopping you from having the power of passion? It's the power of passion that drives us, right? Yes. The power of passion! Yes. The power